Joseph. Welcome back, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, prepare yourselves, because my next guests are the champions of the world's first televised celebrity charity pickleball tournament, Pickled, which premiered tonight on CBS. Please welcome your champions to The Late Show, the Emmy Award-winning host of The Amazing Race, Phil Kogan, and multi-platinum country music star, Dirk Bentley! It's, it's a, what an honor to have you both here. As the world all now know, <laughs> the, you the are champions. the champions of this year's inaugural episode of Pickled. Thank good. you so much. It feels good. It feels really good. Would you care to celebrate your win I with would. a pickleback shot right here? We got whiskey and pickles. Wow. There you go. Another first. Here you go. Uh, and here is to you, gentlemen, volunteering to be in this celebrity pickleball tournament where we raise money for comic relief, yes, which helps well children Steve. and families well in crisis. There well you go. Well there we go. Here we go. Mm. Mm. Nicely done. Mm. Mm. Can I Nothing have like pickle lip? <laughs> sure. Yeah. Nothing <laughs> like backing up your vodka with a gherkin. <laughs> oh. That was nice. That's I never a... loved pickles before I played yeah. pickle. I'm not even kidding. No. And these are really good. You see how we're helping people? That's right. Mm. You, you, of course, are now the proud owners of the <clears throat> Colbert yeah. Cup. There, put it right there. There you go. Look at that. There you go. Um, Stephen, I, I, I don't know if you know, but I, I let Dirks take the trophy. Oh, yes. you did? Yeah. He's, yeah. he's got the trophy. It's well, it's his house. for a year. We, we switched it's yours off, for a year. Yeah, it's oh, like I get it Cup. after a year? Yeah, you get it. I got oh, a few really? months. I'm going to bring it out to you. Now, <laughs> the, your, your team, uh, when Harry Net Rally, Dirk, yes. let me ask you this. Yes. What was your strategy going in? You guys dominated. What was your plan? Our plan was just to win. You know, I like to think that, you know, this is show business, but, you know, this, it's not called show friends. It's called show business. And we were That's there right. to take care of business. That's right. And okay. we did. I mean, we had no, it was not Will Ferrell. You did Ferrell, not make nice any guy. friends. I can promise you that. Uh, uh, I'm no going to say, I'm going to say that Emma, uh, who was definitely the most competitive out of everybody. Emma Watson, who he's talking about. Yes, Emma Watson. Who partnered with Sugar Ray Leonard. She, she came, I, I met her in the makeup room. She was getting her game face on. Uh, then I, the, in there, she was trying to intimidate all of us. So yeah. she told us that she'd had a coach me. for the last month. Yeah. And then when she came out, that evil eye, we I both know. got I it. Still and it. I still right. nightmares about it. It's it got to us. Intensity. It got to us. Mm -hmm. Of all the things that we've done, we looked at each other and we we're like, we're nervous, right? Very. And and because normally you can prepare, Stephen, you can prepare for things. But this was like, I'm going to say we were unprepared, and we were certainly well, unprepared wait, for I her. Take, I yeah. take exception to this because Jimmy Allen. Uh, fellow country star Jimmy Allen yes. outed you, Dirks, because he said that you play pickleball on the road okay. before every uh, show. A couple times. You set up no, a no, court. No, no, no. You set up a we court. We set up courts in all sorts of weird places. Okay. I am. I did play a tournament up in London, Ontario, and my our guitar, guitar player, Ben Helson, and I are the reigning champions of the uh, the 75 and, and older group. We we kind of lie about our age. Sure. But we got the tr we got the win. Like I said. It's all about winning, so whatever it takes. Even you got to fake your age a little bit. Keep it simple. We are 75 and older champions in London, Ontario. So. Yes. Nope. Right. So Phil. Yeah. Phil, you host the Amazing Race, and of course, as tough as nails. Those are, you know, those are very tough competition shows. What was it like to be on the other side of of, of the lens and actually being the person who's actually having to put it out all on the line there? Yeah. You know, when when you host a show where you, you're a musician or you host your show, you do the preparation, yeah. and then you, all the nerves go. You just do your thing. Right. I was so nervous, and and I was I was hoping that you weren't going to be, but you were. I was really. Nervous. I had ne I didn't know about staying out of the kitchen. I didn't know about any of the rules of pickle. I played tennis when I was a kid. Yeah. But that was pretty much it. And we were really a little. We were a nervous wreck going into it. So well, I'm the secret say, the secret of pickleball, in my opinion, yes. is that the best player in the world is about twice as good as the worst player in the world. <laughs> yes. So you can grade After pickleball players. After day one, you're already at like a 90%. Exactly. Yeah. Yes. On a scale of one to two, that's how you rank yeah. pickleball players. Yeah. We got, you we got. came in a solid one and you ended as a two. And that's all it took to beat I, everybody. Yeah. I, I tell you, I felt like an imposter because, you know, 
uh, truth be told, I was kind of called in at the last minute. I we think. had one of our other players. Yes, yeah, someone uh, more famous than me. And I was positive at the <laughs> last <laughs> moment. And so, was it the day before or like literally two it, days I got, before? I got 26 hours warning, I think it was. And, uh, and then, and the, and the executive at CBS called me and goes, you know, I just noticed, Phil, that your name's not on the list. And I'm like, really? And they're like, I, when I found out, I had to do something about it. I said, all right, who got sick? And then there was silence, and there was like, so what are you doing on Friday? And so, you know, I got to turn, but I have but to say. But then you're the champion after not I, training at all, and Emma Watson's over there. I had this moment. MVP Emma Watson. Emma Watson MVP. was like, hey, she like method acted her way through the whole thing. Oh, I don't sure. think she'd played pickleball at all. She hired somebody, and she like took four weeks to become, she was scary. She, she was. She knocked was, him into the back. She put she you on got, your butt. She put me and, and like little blood and stuff. Yeah. But she I, laughed. She are you laughed. saying Emma Watson drew blood on yes. you? Yes. When I went into the back wall, she I ran into the, the back wall. wall. He got yeah. hurt, and she smiled and kind of laughed she about did. it. She yeah. did. She was, like, happy. Famously cruel person. Oh, yeah. Emma Famously Watson. Cruel. It, was, yeah. it was a little hurtful, yeah. to be yeah. honest with you. Because I love her. She's so that's good. That's the motivation we needed to kind of take it to the next level. Dirks, yeah. I, I actually heard that you, your son recently won a championship he did. of his own. Tell me about that. Let's be proud of our children. Yeah, he uh, <laughs> plays travel hockey. I'm a travel hockey dad. My wife, she travels a lot, too. Sure. He's nine. We're just out in Las Vegas. What did he win? For yeah, a big, uh, they won a, a big tournament out there. Actually, speaking of motivation, I, I'm all about finding ways to motivate myself, motivate my family. And uh, Knox's team was kind of getting off to a slow start. Yep. And so me and the, some of the dads had a great idea that Give them extra motivation. We told them if they, they won the championship, we'd take them to Hooters. And <laughs> you're not going to believe it. They won. I mean, they didn't, they didn't let a goal go in the rest How of the series. How old is he? He's nine. I mean, it's the right Dad time. Dad of the year. It's the right time to Dad, start that's about That's really about as old as a person should be and still enjoy going to Hooters. <laughs> 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 well, you know the yes. wings. It's all about the wings. So. Well, uh, listen, people know you as a world-class pickleball player, I know. mostly at this point. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. You, you still do play country music. You're going to perform for us Just tonight. For you. Can Just you, for you share guys. with the people uh, what you're going to be doing? Yeah, I got a brand new song out there. It's uh, called Gold. It's off a record coming out in uh, February, I guess. And it's all about it's all about pickleball, folks. <laughs> Dirks, congratulations. Thank you so much. Phil, thanks so much thanks for being for here, man. Here. There you go. The winners of the Colbert Cup. You can stream Pickle on Paramount Plus and catch Phil on The Amazing Race and Tough as Nails, which premieres January 1st. Jan Dirks Bentley and Phil Kogan, everybody. We'll be right back with a performance by Dirks. <laughs>